The host was Dave Garraway, who was from the morning show, from the Today Show, and he would be in New York, and he would talk to all the people that were at the different places. Live. In, in, in live, including during the rehearsal on a Saturday, we'd have to tap him on the shoulder and say, Dave, say hello to the mayor. Oh, uh, hello, Mayor Elabaternacy. How you been? Good. <laughs> kind of wake him up. I used to uh, play a game with him in the, in the side control room called Dead Actors. He'd say uh, Ronald Coleman, and I'd say somebody. And I'd keep getting one ahead of him until I'd give him Claude Gillingwater. And he said, oh, come on now, Mac. There's no Claude Gillingwater. I said, sure, he was in pictures with Shirley Temple. He was a, oh, you know, I always played the grandfather, you know, and I talked that guy. And the teeth were bigger than his mouth, you know. <laughs> and, uh, and he'd say, you keep getting me with that name. I said, well, don't stop. Just give me another name. Don't stop to argue about there isn't any such person. So you, you two would play the game over? Oh, that was, that, no, that was just off stage. I mean waiting for the next segment to be rehearsed. We'd rehearse it on a Saturday. For, for someone who uh, doesn't know who Dave Garraway is, describe him for us. Well, Dave Garraway was a tall fellow who was kind of the interlocutor on his own show, Garraway at Large, which he started in Chicago. There was the Today Show, the Tonight Show, and the Home Show. They were doing all kinds of things to promote those shows. And those and, are the brainchilds of Pat Weaver. Uh, correct. And uh, all of that stuff was done live. You're just talking about Dave Garraway. D describe him further. W um, what was his talents as a host, uh, his, his personality? Well, he had a great way of uh, interviewing people and talking to them. And uh, I imagine ahead of time, he, he talked over what he was going to ask the person. But he had a always had a twinkle and a happy expression on his face and uh, was, was liked by most everybody that, that I know that worked on the show. We never dreamt that he was going to have such a tragic ending there, but uh, well, you never know what's going on in somebody's mind or the things that have troubled them during the course of their life. But. Uh, he brought a little bit of, of what he did on Garraway and Lodge into the Today Show. And most of his uh, joking around and, and laughing at things was had to do with J. Fred Muggs, the chimpanzee, you know. I don't know how he put up with him, but <laughs> he did.